Hello, in this video we will show how to review CBCT scans. For a quick overview of terms, we will note the crossbars. In between the crossbars is called the target zone. The crossbar has lines, and if you look at the circles, these are grab points or tilting points. Just note your planes, axial, coronal, sagittal, and your 3D rendered image in the right-hand corner. Your orientation boxes, F for foot, A for anterior, L for left, or could be right, and um, you're going to have uh, the R for right and L for left. We will discuss the Alt key for targeting three areas um, in the images. So Alt key on your keyboard. The Alt key targets all three planes. Quick review of mouse terms, left click of the mouse for dragging and rotating. There's a scroll wheel in the middle uh, for uh, slowly uh, slicing. Uh, if you're using a touch screen, you have the slice uh, tab right here that you can use. 3D and its templates. When the screen is loaded, this is your default screen, axial, coronal, sagittal, and your 3D rendering screen. So to start, just left click your mouse, see that curved arrow, and you can rotate around to the uh, 3D. There's the right side, and uh, there's the left side, just for a quick overall evaluation and, uh, from your volume rendered imaging. You may click on a transparent template on the right just to get a, maybe a better view of uh, internal structures on the 3D rendering. If you're using a touchpad, use the curve arrow on the toolbar and use your touchpad for rotation. So for quick scrolling through the arches, put your mouse arrow in the axial screen, hold your index finger down on the left click on the mouse. With it held down, move the mouse up all the way so you can't go any further. There's the um, sinuses and nasal and then you can come down, maxilla, Clusal plane and down all the way through the mandible. Anytime you want to slow down, just press the or uh, scroll the middle wheel on the mouse and you can go a lot slower. You can also grab the pink line and do the same process. Scroll all the way down, and go all the way back up, evaluating as you go. So here in the maxilla, to evaluate the right side, put the arrow in between the crossbars or the target zone, left click your mouse, drag over to the location, and release. You will note the same location from the different planes, axial, coronal, and sagittal. To quickly target with the Alt key, simply press the Alt key down on the keyboard, you get your caliper, move it to the right side, left click and release. Again the same result targeting in all three planes. So now we want to align the green line here in Axial on the right side. Grab your target point or anchor point and drag this green line up and parallel to the right side of the arch. When you release it you can see this becomes your sagittal screen and this is your coronal screen and so you get a better view of all the teeth aligned in that right side. Scroll. Remember green line, right side. To evaluate the left side, you may hit the reset button or drag with the target zone and you may drag over to the other location. This time align the blue line to the left side. Remember blue for left line. Here you can scroll in sagittal, moving a buckle to palatal, or you could grab the line and do the same thing on this screen for evaluation. Same for the mandible. For anterior teeth, use the Alt key and the crossbar alignments. Thanks for watching.